right, hi Capricorn. Welcome and welcome back. This is going to be a weekly reading for you for September 4 through 10. Okay, I'm going to stop the lies. Just stop the lies. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm also getting something about a food allergy. Some of you may have food allergies or experience an allergy to a food in particular this week. You're learning a new allergy or you're there's some kind of flare up. I feel like be mindful. Um, okay. All right, anyway, this is for September 4th through 10. First, we're going to check and see, Capricorn, what energy you're leaving in the past, in the dust. All right, we're not going to give it too much of our attention, time, resources, or any of that stuff, okay? We're just going to check in on it, reflect if need be, learn from it, and move forward, okay? Because that's what the past is for. You're the Ten of Cups, okay? Yeah, so something about your family, your community, feeling like you have everything that you need to feel fulfilled or you've identified it or in the past, yeah, the eight of wands, okay. Your family expanded. Something about your family expanding is what I'm getting. Or there's talk of this, a lot of thoughts of this, or something like that. I feel like there's, there was a lot of laughter in the past, or that that's what you're leaving behind, okay? We're, and again, we're not going to give it too much of our insider energy, okay? Connect intuitively, as always, to get the clearest message for you. A personal issue reaches resolution. Yeah, full moon in cancer. Whatever was going on within your family... Um, I feel like that's done, that's dead, is how I want to say it. Okay, that issue is done. Um, and then you have, yeah, new moon in Sagittarius, focus on the positive. You're moving on from this. You're growing. <clears throat> Sagittarius and Cancer. You have double Sag here. Hmm. All right, show me Capricorn, please. Um, September 4 through 10. Okay, that felt wrong. I'm not really sure why. Monday, you have the strength card coming out. Hmm. Monday seems like a pretty tough day here. I feel like you're trying to keep it to yourself, though. You're trying to be pretty um, strong, resilient. It feels like it has to do with the food allergy message or something to do with your um, um, your gut, okay? Uh, that's just how I have to say it because there, it's that's all encompassing. All right, or something to do with your health in general. We'll we'll see. Tuesday you have the world. Yeah, okay. This is it's over. It's done. Interesting. Wednesday, you have the King of Spheres. That's the King of Pentacles. Thursday, Three of Spheres. Friday, the Star. Saturday, the Ace of Cups. And Sunday, the Moon. Hmm. Bottom of the deck is the Six of Spheres. Yeah. You do have some kind of support here, but it, it feels like it's... Um, it's changed and you're trying to be positive about that like i'm not sure how to explain this let's just see what's the strength card please like something feels less stable but you're trying to just like like i'm i'm hearing it, it feels like somebody is having a panic attack and in, internally but and then they're they're like talking themselves through it but all of this is going on inside okay so you're holding a lot in keeping a lot in here all right what is the strength card trying not to say something as well or um in particular the emperor yeah this is just what you feel like you have to do this is i don't know yeah, the Queen of Cups, but you're experiencing a lot internally. 
What else is here? The Four of Wands. Hmm. Alright, let's see what this moon is on um, Sunday. The Eight of Wands, and it's coming out reversed, and the Queen of Cups. Yeah, I feel like Capricorn. You're you again. You're you're holding a lot in, not really telling people or someone in particular what it is that you're experiencing, and it feels like that is. Um, creating discomfort okay yeah that's what I have for you